Uh, can I ask you, uh, in terms of um, you know the deep state and conspiracy mm -hmm. theories, there's a lot of talk about, so f again, from an outsider's perspective, if I were just looking at Twitter, it seems that at least 90% of people in government are pedophiles. <laughs> At 90, 90 to 95%, I'm not sure what that number is. Yeah. <laughs> if I were to just look at Twitter, honestly, or YouTube, I would think most of the world is a pedophile. <laughs> I would almost feel like. Right. Who? And if you, if you don't fully believe that, you're a pedophile. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. I would start to wonder, like, wait, am I, like, yeah. what? Am I a pedophile too? <laughs> like, I'm either a communist or a pedophile, or both, I guess. Uh, yeah, that's going to be clipped out. Thank you, yeah, internet. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I look forward to your yeah. emails. Uh, but is there any kind of shadow conspiracy theories that uh, give you pause? Or um, so the flip side, the response to a lot of conspiracy theories, it's like, no, the reason this happened is because it's a combination of just incompetence. So where do you land on some of these uh, conspiracy theories? I think most conspiracy theories are wrong. Some are true, and those are spectacularly true. And if that makes sense, yeah. Um, I and we don't know which ones. Though. I don't know which one. That's the problem. I think. Oh well. I mean, look, man. I listened to your podcast. I think I was a huge non-believer in UFOs, and now I've probably never believed more in UFO. Like I, yeah. I, I believe in UFOs. Like yeah. I'm very comfortable being like. Not only do I believe in UFOs, like I think we're probably being visited by an alien civilization. Yes. Like, and if you asked me that three years ago, I would be like, "You're out of your fucking mind!" Like, what are you talking about? Well, listen to David Fravor. That's yeah. all I have to say. That's it. Well, like, I, I have the sense yeah. that the government has information that hasn't revealed, but it's not like they're. I don't think they're holding. There's like a, a green guy sitting right. there in a room. Exactly. exactly. They just they have seen things they don't know what to do with. So, so it's like they're confused. Like they're afraid. Uh, yeah. Of, of of revealing that they don't know. That's that what I think know. it is. Right. They, right. It's revealing the yeah exactly that <laughs> yeah. they don't know, and then they're in the process. There's a lot of fears tied up in that. Right. First, looking incompetent in the public eye. Nobody wants mm -hmm. to be uh, looked that way. And the other is like in revealing it, even though they don't know. Maybe China will figure it out. Exactly. <laughs> so, like, we don't want China to figure it out first, and so that all those kinds of things result in basically secrecy. Then that damages the trust in institutions. On one of the most fascinating aspects, like one of the most fascinating mysteries of humankind, of is there life, intelligent life out there in the universe? So that's one of them. But there, there's other ones. Like uh, for me, when I first came across actually Alex Jones. Mm -hmm was uh 911. Yeah. I remember like uh, cuz I was um I was in Chicago. I was thinking like, oh shit, are they going to hit Chicago too? <laughs> <laughs> That's what everybody was thinking. Yeah, everybody yeah. everybody was thinking like right. what does this mean? It's scale, what scale? What I mean right. trying to interpret it. And I remember like looking for information desperately like what what happened? Mm -hmm. What And I remember not being satisfied with the quality of reporting and figuring out like rigorous like here's exactly what happened. And so people like Alex Jones stepped up and others that said like, there's some shady shit going on. And yeah. it sure as hell looked like there's shady shit going on. Yes. Uh, so like, and I still stand behind the fact that it seems like there's not, I, there's not enough, in, like it wasn't a good job of being honest and transparent and all those kinds well, of things. Because it would implicate the Saudis, let's be honest. Right? And see, <laughs> see that's, that's my conspiracy theories. I'm like, yeah, I think they covered up a lot of stuff because they wanted to cover up for the kingdom of Saudi Arabia. Like, and then, I mean, that is a, that was a conspiracy theory not that long ago. I think it's true. I mean, yeah. I think it's 100% true. 